The search for missing actor Julian Sands has come to a tragic end. According to authorities, remains belonging to the 65-year-old were found by hikers on June 24th in a wilderness area on Southern California's Mount Baldy. Per a June 27th news release from the San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department, while the coroner has positively identified the body, the cause and manner of death has not been determined, pending further test results. News of Sand's death comes six months after he disappeared during an excursion on the mountain, located about 50 miles east of Los Angeles. He was reported missing on January 13th, and one day later, a delayed ping through his Apple iPhone operating system came in off one of the trails leading to the summit. Rescuers scoured the area both on foot and by helicopter, though the search was called off on January 15th due to avalanche risks and extreme weather conditions. At the time, authorities said the sheriff's department urges everyone to stay away from that area. It is extremely dangerous, even for the skilled hiker. While the search for Sands resumed earlier this month, with over 80 volunteers, deputies and staff scouting his possible last location, a June 17th news alert read, Unfortunately, Mr. Sands was not located despite the recent warmer weather. Portions of the mountain remain inaccessible due to extreme alpine conditions. Multiple areas include steep terrain and ravines, which still have 10-plus feet of ice and snow. Born in England, Sands had been a resident of California since 2020 and was best known for his breakout role in 1985's A Room with a View. His other film credits include Warlock, Arachnophobia, and Leaving Las Vegas. Plus, he made appearances on TV shows such as 24, Smallville, Banshee, and Dexter. The Independent reports Sands is survived by his longtime wife and his three adult children. In a June 24th statement, his family told the outlet, We continue to hold Julian in our hearts with bright memories of him as a wonderful father, husband, explorer, lover of the natural world and the arts, and as an original and collaborative performer.